Hi guys, Squall here and welcome back to another episode of Bus Simulator. If you remember in the last episode, I kind of messed up. <laughs> I created a route that was meant to take this first box here. And I actually messed it up and drove a route which didn't take the box and then drove a route which did. So that's where we are. We, we, we did that. that. That happened. Moving on. We're going to now do this one, which is have a, uh, a bus stop which um, has one bus stop in each unlock district. Maximum of five stops. Then assign a driver to it and drive the route and try to assign a driver to it. it needs to be at, um, 10 minutes or less. So what we'll do is we'll edit this route here. The third one. And we'll backtrack again. So we'll get rid of these. So it needs to be 10 minutes or less. So what we can do is we can go blue, green, purple. That gives us a route time of 5 minutes. Now arguably... Arguably, that's not an express bus service because an express bus <laughs> service generally goes from kind of one part of town to another but misses out a lot of the stops on the way, just stops at the major ones, right? But there appears to be no distance limit in this particular scenario, so this seems to be fine. So I'm going to do three very absurd stops and hopefully it'll, it'll take that and tick the box because we've only got it... Well, actually, I've got to drive it first and then we've got to put a uh, an AI driver in. So we'll do those two, and hopefully that'll take it. Oh, it's raining. Lovely. Right, speed limits on. I can break off. Let's go. Look at them wipers. Look how realistic that is. I mean, everything about the wipers, the size, the speed, the movement, the way they're clearing off the water that isn't accumulating on the glass, it's just so real. Look at the raindrops on the floor. Look okay. at <laughs> that is arguably arguably the kind of rain that you would see 10 years ago in a game I must admit that is awful they've got everything else though like the, the lighting the mood of it is good the, the trees are amazing the trees are incredible but the rain is just so rubbish uh, a student one trip let's go that's two, three, and five. Next, move. Uh, two seniors. Give me five. That's three and five. Bloke the phone, get on. You'd think a guy in a suit with a mobile phone in his hand in the pouring rain with no umbrella would be pretty keen to get on the bus. But apparently not. This is an express. An express bus to hell. Come on, traffic lights. Be green for once. Yeah, I need to stop with the traffic accidents because they seem to hurt you... Um, hurt you in the pocket quite a bit. And I'm quite keen to avoid that. Who's getting off? Why has that woman got a shiny light on her, on her hand? What's that about? Oh. No, don't change! I'm an express bus! Come on! On you get! Okay. You're not getting on this way. Fuck. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where did you come from, dude? Seriously? I don't get that. Like, that guy must have appeared from nowhere. Because if I hadn't taken him, though, it'd have probably said, Oh, you missed a passenger. Next stop, Junction Street West. This is the last stop. Make sure to take all of your belongings with you before stepping off the bus. It's always a good idea to take your belongings with you, I find. Yeah, as I was saying, the trees, look at them, they're amazing. They're so good. They're so well done. And yet, the rain is pants. Right, final destination. Then we can get a driver on the world's most unprofitable route. Junction Street West. 
All change, please. Get off in the rain. Bye. Yeah. Okay. Driver level up. Uh, the following drivers reached new level and now want more money. Cindy wants 810 per month. GG for her. Hopefully no more expenses. Yeah, that's good. That was a better profit. 9,000 profit. That's good. And we leveled up. Yay! What's the... Ooh, look at that. New bus colour. Um, Wait, what? That's not a bus colour. A bus model. And a new driver. What's the new bus model? Shop. <gasps> the Bendy X70. MANs! Oh, level 13 and 16. Look. MANs at level 13. Nice. Okay, we've unlocked a Bendy bus. That's 270,000 to get the Bendy bus. That's a lot. We've only got 111. Um, we could sell... Oh, man. How are we going to get that much money? Like, I could get it if I... Hang on, 111, plus we sell that for 99. We have, like, 200. That's still not enough. Wow. I think we might have to just buy a cheap bus. Like a 90 grand bus or something. We can actually afford that one. 30, 41 seats, bending no. 2005 model. How much is our... T We've got a 2005 model that's selling for 89 grand, and yet they're only 90 to buy. If we buy that, it'll give us four buses. We can hire a driver and make more money more quickly. So it won't get us the bendy bus as soon, but it's probably a wise move, and we can always sell it. I don't think it'll depreciate that much, so I'm going to buy that. Um, our latest 90 grand bus. They're a bit rubbish, but I'll just get an AI to drive it. It's fine. <laughs> okay, let's do it in corporate colours. Let's apply that. Let's get the decals going. Uh, let's get the Doyle paw on the side. Who's Doyle? Doyle's my dog. My lovely Westy dog. Hence the dog print. Uh, that one will have a dog paw... You can actually make your own decals, you know. I think it's just a... Like a BMP file or something that you put into the right place and it you can then apply it, which I might have to do at some point. Um, put one there. Let's make it the right colour. Scale it down. Just put dog prints all over the bus. <laughs> as you do. That'll do. And then the all-important ads, which we can vary now because we've actually got another one. So we'll put them up there because they bring in money. I just love the way you can do this. Just put them ads on the roof. I mean, what a what a great position. That's going to bring in two grand a week. Let's exit that. So now back on the route thingy, what that means is we're now free to get the AI driver. Oh, we need to hire a driver. Okay, let's have a look at some applications. Uh, who's the most expensive? Rebecca, no, hang on. These aren't in order of... Are they in order of skill? Novice, scholar... Yeah, they're in order of skill, not money. That's interesting, because this guy who's a scholar wants way more than this guy who's a scholar. Rebecca Slushny started four different bachelor's degrees. Okay, so she can't finish anything, is what we're saying. No Boston driving experience. No, just no. You can't finish a job. You might, you might get assigned a bus route, and then you'll do three stops and get bored of it. No, I don't want you. Skilled car mechanic, former high tonnage trucker, enjoys small talk a lot. He's He would do very well on a bus. Because if his bus breaks down, and if we give him like the really old bus and it breaks down, he can get out and fix it himself. Uh, he's used to driving big vehicles, and he can chat with the passengers. Enjoy small talk. He's perfect. Daniel Greenis was a police officer. Hmm. Changed sides. Okay, so what does that mean? What, what is he now, then? A, a criminal? Is he going to, like, em embezzle money off me? Love to take the bus as a child. Can't differentiate between running green. You see, you're not going to do well at traffic lights, Daniel, in all honesty. Finished high school the second time. No bus driving experience at all. Likes happy people. Others not so much. Well, you can't be that picky in life. Not everybody's going to be happy, are they? Skilled car mechanic. Little experiences drive. Passionate for... Okay, I'm going to go with it. Daniel. I'm going to go with it. No, no, not Daniel. Not Daniel. Good grief, no. Burned. This guy, he's expensive, but I like him. I think he'll do well in my company. So let's go with him. 
which means we can now click on that one and then we can assign a driver our experienced driver can run our express bus service <laughs> we're now free to create another route for ourselves buy a bendy bus well we can't do that yet have at least five different routes you and your drivers drove last week now this one requires us to have yet another bus so we've already got three um on the sorry four buses and three drivers so we just need to have one more bus which means we're going to need a, another 90 to 100k have at least 90 percent of your bus stops as part of your routes driven by you and your drivers last week well 90 percent that's that's an interesting one as it happens uh what i think we'll do is we'll do this in two stages all right i don't want to just edit that route now because if i edit that route now i'll have to drive it and i won't be able to earn any money from it so what i'll do is i'll create a route that will pick up uh most of this district here uh this, these purple dots we'll try and pick up most of that and then i'll assign the driver to that one then we'll edit this garden lane route and make it pick up the rest and that will tick that box off and maybe by then we'll have enough money to buy another bus so let's start off by creating a new route for ourselves to drive and we're going to start um see that stop there it says 90 percent of stops in theory i could leave that one out but in all honesty i'm kind of fed up of coming at this from this direction so i think what i'd like to do is figure out a different journey i might leave that one out instead so what i'll do is i'll start here we'll come around there like that no we'll not go that we'll do that first then we'll go to here then we'll go around to there then we'll drive let's go across to here back to that one and then finally finish here and then here so that's a long old journey that is but it picks up every single stop in that district so it'll be perfect to give to an AI driver. And this is quite a wealthy district as well. So in theory, it should do well. Now, I won't take the 38G because that's the basic one. I'll carry on with the C58B and we'll drive that. Okay, now given the length of this journey, um, speed limiter on, there is a scope for something to go wrong. There's a very big scope for something to go wrong. Could be I'm going to crash my vehicle, I hit a pedestrian... You know, whatever. I have managed to drive a route in this game before, and right near the end of the route, a pedestrian has stepped out, and it terminates the route. It's absolutely annoying. Lower Moat Street East. Wow, you're just happy to get on my bus. One regular latte coming up. You give me five. That's uh, three and five. Next. Have a great day. I will. Please feel free to sit down. I would invite you to put your seatbelt on, but there aren't any. You know what? I'm sure on coaches they have um, seatbelts. I'm sure they do now, but on buses they don't. It's weird, isn't it? You would have thought buses would have uh, seatbelts. Maybe it's the speed thing. Maybe it's the something to do with the top end speed of a bus. But having said that, buses can go like... Modern buses can go 50, 60, no problem. I don't know. That's the river on our left. That's a guy with a mobile phone who apparently can't walk and text at the same time. Okay, right turn. Yeah, so I think this journey is a little bit more interesting to the ones we've done before. We've not been down some of these roads. So it would be kind of nice to see some new places. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Thank you. Okay, so you have to give way to her, even though she's finished. Try not to hit that guy. Right, second stop is further down here. Why is that a billboard? I actually thought that was like a logo for something. It is. KW. We're now entering the uh, the modern district, the financial powerhouse. Maybe 
See, this would have been better suited for the express route. I don't understand why that scenario, the express one, I don't understand why it didn't give you a minimum distance. Like, I can understand it saying a maximum time of whatever, 15 minutes, say. But a minimum distance of, I don't know, one kilometre. Because I just made the most absurd route last time to complete the journey. Come on, everybody on the bus, please. Stop texting. Two tickets, please. Two tickets, senior. You got it. You give me a five, because you always do. Thank you very Two much. Tickets, please. Two seniors again? We all going to the same place? We all go to bingo or something? Thanks. Have a great day. You're welcome. I'll nail the bus. So we need to turn right here. This is like the main square plaza bit in the middle here. Which we're going to come back over again later. Right, I'm going to stop here. Because I think these guys are going to cross. Whoa, he got wiped out. Did you see it? That was amazing. Well, that confirms something. The AI vehicles and pedestrians do not interact. You said they've all got American accents. It just doesn't fit. Like, who did they make this game for? What market? Why put it on it? Seriously, they may as well just put this onto a US sit onto a US fictional city, or just get yourself some European um, voiceovers. Because what they've done makes no sense to me. They should have done a few voice packs and given the option and just going, what kind of locale do you want? Oh, hi. A ticket, please. Student ticket, uh-huh. Uh, that's two, three, and five. Thank you, dear. Did he say thank you, dear, or did I just hear that? Because I really hope he didn't. Look at the queue behind me. The life of a bus driver. Notice I've turned off SLI. And my, te my texture flickering is gone. However, I noticed the radio then is still messed up. Look, look at that. That's insane. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought he was going to pull out. But yeah, the flickering's gone. So it was an SLI thing. I think it's to do with the way the program, the code, like the game stores textures in the graphics card. That's the weirdest statement. As if your eyes change colour depending on the food you eat. As if. Oh, don't throw up. Don't throw up and get on my bus, dude. Seriously. One ticket, regular, please. One regular. Okay. That's three and five. Thank you, I think I'll need several tickets, please. Several? You need a couple. I want to be picky here, but you want two. Uh oh. Oh, you give me a ten? That's unusual. Got change for the shop. Yeah. Next time, bring some change with you, bro. Hate that. I used to do that when I was younger. I used to go into a shop, like, because I didn't have any change. Are you crossing? No. So you go into a shop with your £10 note and buy a bag of crisps <laughs> just so that you can get a lot of change. It's basically the equivalent of that. I wonder if they ever plan to change the sat-nav. Yeah, right. True story, bro. If you're a, ne a neurosurgeon, I'm Santa Claus. 
Okay, we want left turn. So far, so good. Not managed to trash the vehicle yet. It's quite uh, splendid around this part of town, actually. Wow, they've actually got vehicles parked on the uh, on the pavement there. Look, don't they normally have underground car parks at these buildings? Stop whistling on my bus. Whistling is banned on my bus. Shut up. Seriously, shut up. Whoever that is, get off. Get off. If I find you. Good day. Regular single trip, please. You better sleep with one eye open tonight. One regular ticket. We're up to three and five. Have a nice day. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Now right, you stop whistling. Scumbag. People who, honestly, people who whistle really loudly. So annoying. It's like nobody wants to hear you whistle. I guess the speed limit's a thing, right? I guess you'd turn it off if you were late, wouldn't you? But the thing is, I find the speed cameras in this game very hard to spot. Like, if I knew where they were, I wouldn't be so bad, but... I think they're all hidden. So I'll just leave the speed limits on. Between stops, you've either got no time at all, or like this, you've just got an absurd amount of time. Get to the next bus stop in, in almost three minutes. Like, really? Awesome, awesome driving. Zoo. Hello. One, regular, One regular latte coming up. That's three and five. Thanks. I have a great day. Another reg. Do they ever give you anything else? Thank you, dear. He did. He did say thank you, dear. What the heck is going on? Oh my god. I thought I misheard him last time. Cold Convention Center. I'll get them some heating here one day. Come on, thank you. I think the Track IR guys actually wrote to um, wrote to uh, the developers of this game and said to them be quite happy to help them get Track IR in the game. I wonder if they'll actually do that. I've not really seen much in the way of patches for this game yet. Yeah. I wish I could change that to uh, ask you to please not whistle while you're on his bus. Come on, love. That's it. Thank you. Almost done with this. That's really cool. It's been quite a good earner, this one. I reckon we'll clear it at least... 11 or 12 grand on this run, at least. Even more had it been a tourist thingy as well. Convention Center. She's waiting for somebody to get off the bus. No, she's just making me wait. No, she is, she's getting on the back. Okay, I think the next one might be the last stop. In which case... Next stop, Junction Street West. This is the last stop. Yay! Make sure to take 
In which case, I've had a near perfect drive. I've not hit anything yet. Of course, you're all sitting there thinking, oh, you just jinxed it now, squirrel. You're going to hit something now. <laughs> well, that might happen. We'll see. I'm staying away from the guy in front a bit. I don't trust him. I think he's going to brake test me. SAS JM1. Did you see the suspension on that car then? Honestly. He needs some springs. Look, look at that. <laughs> the suspension is real, that's amazing. That would break your back, that would, good grief. Has he have they all just lowered the cars round here? And put fast and furious suspension on. Oh, I can see the stop. It's so close. Just down this road to victory. Let's go. Because this route is quite a good one. I think I'll leave the AI driver on it for quite a while. Because it just covers every single stop in this district. So it's a cracking route to have. Like I say, it should earn quite well. Everybody off, please. All change, please. All change. Nice. That's how we did. Oh, I like that. I'm liking the sound of that. Well, we didn't just clear 12 grand. We claimed 13 grand. Oh, nearly hit another level. That was a good earner. We've now got 20 grand in the bank. Awesome. So on that journey, we can now... Let's take... We'll take this guy away. Because he's pretty good. And we'll put him on this one here. Right? Because that's a cracking route. And this route here, which was just absurd, we'll delete that. There you go. So now we've got three decent routes which only leaves us to create uh because we we're trying to do this one here uh 90 percent of your bus stops that's what we're trying to do we're trying to get that one done so we just need to create one more route now which picks up those stops here and look at that it's beautiful that should pick up everything and then we'll be done but that is going to have to wait for the next video i hope you enjoyed that guys please give me a thumbs up if you did until the next one take care happy busing